Lomas puts in the cross from the right hand side and it's headed oh to the crossbar by Matthew Hardiman lacks defending there from Coventry United a cracking opportunity if Hardiman just kept his head if he kept his head down it would have gone straight in but it's a little bit too much height and the attempt at goal from the, the left winger another great chance to whip this one in it's cleared in the near post by Flowers the Corey will head it to Hudson another crossing opportunity He's worked his way, passes opposite number three. Hudson still going and saved by the goalkeeper. Oh, Grady puts the rebound over the crossbar with Stone on the ground. United's best chance of the game. Great work from Hudson to get himself around Adam Robinson into the penalty area. Parried well by Aiden Stone. Although Grady unable to turn the rebound into the net. It remains 0-0 at Sphinx Drive. Beckley as you to look to make their way into the Brockton half play back to Lewis Hudson now Cox Dells right behind him but Cox able to release the ball and find Kevin Thornton striding forward under pressure from Wilson Thornton puts into the penalty area great chance now for Ben Mackey blocked well from Ben Taylor Mackey would be disappointed with that one and should have taken it quicker <laughs> Throwing is put in and headed out but it will fall to Pierre Moudin Lays it off to Thornton. O'Grady on the right, looking to put one, put this one back into the into the penalty area. And it's Thornton. O'Grady. Moodin. Is it up to Thornton? And back to O'Grady. Shooting opportunity now for Josh O'Grady. Oh, he's found the top corner. The wait is over. Josh O'Grady's first league goal of the season. We've had to wait for it, but it was well worth the wait. O'Grady finds the top scorer. That's what we want to see. We haven't seen the best of him so far this season. But Joshua O'Grady is off the mark in the Midland League Premier Division. And in some style, great work there between Moody and Thornton and O'Grady. And last season's top scorer was offered a brilliant opportunity. And he found the top corner with the greatest of ease. Coventry United 1, Brockton 0. Welcome back to the score sheet, Joshua O'Grady. Well, as we say, it's been a difficult season for O'Grady so far. That is, I believe, his first league goal of the season after around 35 last year. United having to stave off some pressure from Brockton. And now they come away once again with O'Grady. Cox wants it forward. O'Grady cutting in. He's got his confidence back and finds Thornton. Is that the goal? The catalyst that United need. And Thornton into the penalty. Now take the pass the defender. Wow! Kevin Thornton joins in the fun! Incredible run from Thornton into the penalty area. Beats one, beats two, boom! Pass the goalkeeper. Well, goals are like buses in Coventry. You wait for one for half an hour, and then two come along at once. And it's Kevin Thornton who makes it 2 0 for Coventry United. What a couple of minutes for the Red and Greens. They've dominated the game and now they're showing it on the score sheet. Coventry United 2, Brockton 0. O'Grady wants it through on the right-hand side. He's got the ball. and made try from long range. He deflected yeah. and into the net. Josh O'Grady's waited two months for a league goal and now he's got two in the game. Josh O'Grady makes it 3-0. Had a helping hand on the way through from the leg of a Brockton defender, but O'Grady will not care one jot about that. Coventry United 3, Brockton 0. Wilson, under pressure from the core, he's being forced back into his defence. Taylor, Coleman tried to let that go forward to Morris, but Dell will not tune now as he cuts into the penalty area and makes it 3-1. Coleman's got to take the blame for that one, allowing the ball to run past him. Believing there was no one there, but Dominic Dell, Dominic Dell able to pick up the ball and slide it past Rich Morris. An error, a very rare error there from Jamie Coleman, allowing Brockton to get themselves on the score sheet. Is it the start of a comeback or a consolation goal? We'll have to wait and see. But whatever the circumstance, it's Coventry United 3, Brockton 1. Friendship taken by Matthew Dean on the right-hand side for Brockton. Inside United's half, Lomas, Cox able to uh, dispossess him, but loses it to Dell. Dean, Dell on the right, surrounded by red shirts, and eventually United 
Well, uh, Lolo went out to me, but the referee has not seen it. And you actually could pay for that as it's an attempted chance here from. Oh, it's just over! What a choosing there from Josh Wilson, a couple of Brockton fans in front of us celebrating. Well, Rich Morris obviously knew it was going over because he didn't move. A long range effort there from Josh Wilson. It was a cracking attempt. It did make the net, uh, the net rattle, but thankfully for United, it was on the wrong side of the net. Dell. Oh, good interception there from Lewis Hudson. O'Grady wants it forward and he puts it through. Josh O'Grady to make it four. Oh, brilliant save. And Hudson couldn't control it. Fulton and again save. Brilliant double save there by Aiden Stone. And it will be, well, it's kept in. Now Hudson, side challenge there from Matthew Dean. And it will be a corner kick. There's Josh O'Grady once again cutting in. Tries to lay off Cox. And here is Chris Cox. He's passed one defender. Chris Cox! Bottom corner! You don't keep them out, Chris Cox rounds it off with a go. That's two goals in two games with the skipper. Low and hard into the bottom corner. Coventry United have been dominant today. And it shows on the score sheet. Coventry United 4, Brockton 1. And just a couple of minutes until the referee blows the whistle for the final time. I really just put the icing on the cake.